Hi, I'm a student. Before I go through my million problems, let's start with my name. My name is Nsini Muraudzi, better known as Distom. My name is a bit tough to pronounce. It gets worse when I meet a beautiful lady and on the following day she can remember my name. Or remember me for that matter. And I just turn into a creep trying to convince the lady that she knows me. And then it's game over. So Distom it is. I'm from a village. I'm poor. My dad keeps reminding me that I should graduate and buy me his first car. It said, I know, buying the car is the least of my worries. Well, graduating, on the other hand, is a sensitive matter. I'm a good guy. I eat my veggies. I do my homework. And I'm single. Not because of the blood of Jesus and what what. Because these girls reject me. I try. I really try. Unlike Mr. Why Not Both, I count every cent. My dad keeps on asking me, who my girlfriend is. I disappoint him every time. Since I'm in Cape Town, I fear that he might think the boy is gay. He's convinced that I have his good looks. But I don't want to break his spirit by telling him what the girls think about my looks. I spend my life at school, studying, and I still fail horribly. And I'm smart. There's this one girl that I like very much. But that's a story for another day. In fact, enough about me. He is one of my closest friends, Samuele as the white people call him, Samuel. I like spending time with this guy. He is in his seventh year of a four-year degree. We joke about our failures every day. According to him, the record time for his degree is four years. The average time is six years. <laughs> so we laugh to make him happy. We say this is his final year. It's a great response. It doesn't have a lot of buts and maybes. It hides all failures. We count from the end going backwards. So yes, final year. The problem is he has been in his final year for a few years now. Now the problem with that is when there's a person who asked about Samuel's academics last year asks about them again this year. But that is his problem. Now Samuel is measuring in those programming courses. The only time I saw him programming was the day he modified copy and paste. I mean, when you copy the word boy, it pays out young men. It's a really great piece of work. It saved us from exclusion. And respect him for that. We need more people like him. You see, Samuel is one of those friends that makes you feel good about yourself. When the lecturer calculates our averages, you know when they go maximum mark minus minimum mark? It's because of Samuel that my mark is not one of those two marks. And I repeat, we need more people like him. So, this place is not so bad. Things go wrong, we get used to it. We are surprised every day. Brother, can I introduce you to God the Mother? In telling you that I'm in need of your love, baby. Yeah. This is the Mr. Masih. Maybe girl, this life is too fast for me. I just wanna be with you and be free. Study so hard and just get my degree. Start a family with you overseas, yeah.